हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन फर्स्ट चैप्टर प्रीवियसली वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट दिस थ्री टॉपिक्स वन टू थ्री नाउ वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट फोर फोर्थ टॉपिक दैट इज सिंपल न्यूमेरिकल एग्जांपल्स रिलेटेड टू दीज आर द एग्जांपल्स बेस्ड ऑन प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ फ्लूड बट बिफोर सॉल्विंग दीज एग्जांपल्स लेट वी डिस्कस द यूनिट कन्वर्जन दैट इज वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट टू सोल्व एनी एनी एग्जाम्पल suppose first is 1 kg is equal to 1000 g that we know it's very easy similarly 1 liter is equal to how many cm cube or meter cube to understand this let we take a cube of size 10 cm by 10 cm by 10 cm say height width and length all parameters are 10 cm so its volume is equal to 1000 cm cube obviously volume is equal to lbh and this 1000 cm cube is equal to 1 liter if you put or fill up water in this tank then its volume is 1 liter take a cube of size 1 meter by 1 meter by 1 meter suppose this is a cube then the volume is obviously 1 meter cube and, and if it and its volume is 1000 liter so 1 meter cube is equal to 1000 liter or we have to remember this entity 1 liter is equal to 1000 cm cube or 1 meter cube is equal to 1000 liter it will be useful to us to solve the examples based on proper now example number 1 5 liter of water is filled up in a container find out mass of water so for water we know 1 liter is equal to 1 kg so obviously 5 liter is equal to 5 kg that is answer of this problem second problem an oil having mass of 4.8 kg volume of 5 liter find out density of oil so mass is given that is 4.8 kg volume is given 5 liter so convert liter into meter cube divide it by 1000 so 0.005 meter cube is the volume density is equal to mass upon volume so 4.8 upon 0.005 that is 960 kilogram per meter cube that is the density of given oil example number 3 an oil having specific gravity 0.9 find out mass of 10 liter oil specific gravity is given as 0.9 density is 0.9 into 1000 kilogram per meter cube because we know specific gravity is the ratio of density of fluid upon density of water so from specific gravity if specific gravity is given multiply it by 1000 then we can find out the density of that fluid that is 900 kg per meter cube volume is given as 10 liter so 10 upon 1000 that is 0.01 meter cube so convert liter into meter cube then density is equal to mass upon volume put the values of each entities so mass is equal to density into volume rearrange the above equation density is 900 kg per meter cube volume is 0.01 meter cube meter cube meter cube gets cancelled and mass is equal to 9 kg that is the answer of this problem means if a oil an oil which is 10 liter by volume and its specific gravity is 0.9 then it its mass will be 9 kg example number 4 find out density of edible oil available at your home so for this you have to take reading from an oil tank edible oil that is available at your home suppose let let us assume the printed data on this tank suppose this is a tank of oil mass is 15 kg and volume is written as 16 liter means this is written on every every oil tank so 16 liter means 16 upon 1000 meter cube that is 0.016 meter cube density is equal to mass upon volume so 15 upon 0.016 so 937.5 kg per meter cube that is the density of given edible oil you can do this experiment at your home at your home also now true or false 1 kg is equal to 9.81 newton no uh, yes it's true oil paint is the newtonian fluid it's a true or false false it is non newtonian fluid because it is it does not obey newton's law of viscosity compressible fluid has variable density true or false yes it's true 
density varies for a compressible fluid because when we apply uh, pressure and if its, its volume changes its density will change then fourth is intermolecular forces are very high in gas it's false because in gas intermolecular forces are very less now some si units that you have to remember always unit of mass is kilogram unit of volume is meter cube unit of density that is kilogram per meter cube specific gravity has no unit specific volume meter cube per kilogram viscosity pascal second or newton second per meter square capillarity is meter or centimeter of fluid surface tension that is newton per meter kinematic viscosity meter square per second specific weight newton per meter cube force newton by pressure newton per meter square or pascal shear stress newton per meter square or pascal work that is newton meter or newton into meter or it is called as joule power that is newton meter per second or joule per second or watt and energy that is joule so i hope uh, all con concepts are clear to you feel free to contact me for any query thanks for watching